Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to Bali Texture. We're back in the beautiful land of Bali, Indonesia. My name is Ross. I will be your host today. We are in Pereranan. Pereranan is in the popular area of Canggu and it's known for being a little more peaceful, a little more laid back. What we have for you today is two tiny homes, something new that we're very excited to show you. So think of all the amenities, everything you would get from a nice villa, all compact into something more affordable, but not sacrificing on any luxury. So strap yourself in, put a smile on your face, and let's get ready to have some fun today. Now when you first look at the villa, what you're gonna notice immediately is the beautiful exterior. There's blacks with rich woods. It really has a nice modern design. And throughout this whole space, you're gonna see some really amazing quality materials. Like this is Jogja. It's a natural stone. It's from a city in Java. I'm stepping on ironwood right now by the pool, which is uh, really weather resistant and a really high quality wood to use for decking. You're gonna notice, you've seen in some other videos, this green, kind of tint we have in the pool comes from Sukabumi stone. It kind of has that green look, also has some healing properties, so they say. Um, you can find this in Java as well. We have a nice little area here to hang out on. You can dip your toes, refresh, because it gets a little hot in Bali. And also a nice feature outside is you're gonna notice there's a bunch of different shades of green from all the plant life. And then also looking at the exterior, it's cool how there's like vines and plants up there, but also hanging down. It gives it a really nice, like, jungly feel as well. Out here, hang out, open air. They've really done a nice job with the pool in the air out here, giving you the most bang for your buck. Also, notice the shape of the pool is very unique. It kind of has somewhat of an hourglass figure. It's like a custom kind of job. But overall, the exterior, I love. Now it's time to go inside and show you what we're working with. Hey, this would also be a really amazing time just to tickle that like button, hit that subscribe if you wanna see more videos. We appreciate you being here, thank you. So come on in. Let me show you the layout, the lay of the land. First of all, the ceiling is beautiful. The nice wood. There's also a lot of jati as a type of wood from Indonesia, both in the steps, some of the furniture here. You guys saw this stone outside, the Jogja stone. It's just a really lovely natural stone. It gives it a really like earthy feel. It also goes good with on the other side, you're gonna see the concrete render uh, walls. And this is the live tree. Look at that, it's planted. Now, if that doesn't say Bali, I don't know what does. Comment below and let me know who has an actual live tree in their house. I'd love to know. Um, so moving on to the kitchen, you have a nice dining area, you seat six. You're gonna notice back there the big open windows. It really lets the light in, shine a light on your dinner party. We've got a fridge, everything we need back here. Really nice countertop here. I love the black on the sink. Got your kitchen, of course. But really it's like, again, it's full features of what you would get in a nice villa and a really nice compact area, but they've spared no expense when it comes to getting really nice, high quality materials from all over Indonesia. So this is the living room layout. Let me know what you guys think. And now we will head up to the bedroom. All right, we are upstairs now. And the first thing you're gonna see is this beautiful pitched ceiling made from teak. Teak is very popular here in Indonesia, very durable, but also very elegant wood. The second thing you're gonna see, so much space for a tiny home. They've really done a great job with building a bedroom that makes you feel very comfortable. I don't feel cramped at all. There's a desk over here, wonderful spot for the bed. This is a really cool feature too. It's a semi-exposed bathroom. So you have the sinks out here, then the bathroom behind. Also look at this nice uh, darker terrazzo sink. You got the his and hers sections, fun mirrors. 
uh, a nice concrete render on the wall. The tile is the same from down below. It's a ceramic tile. And if you look at the bed and also these lights, it has kind of a, a bit of a boho vibe and feel to it, which I appreciate as well. Also, the creams give it a nice cooling kind of energy in here, very relaxing. I love this wooden kind of checkerboard they have back here. The wooden pieces come out to like different um, lengths to give it a nice texture. And then of course, you have the open view of Bali. Uh, I think I'm gonna be here for a minute, so uh, maybe catch you guys in the next spot. So I also want to mention the bathroom features. We have the same teak in the ceiling. They've even put some ironwood, or ulin as they say here, down to just have a really nice feel on your feet while you're showering. This is the first time I've seen this in Bali and I really appreciate it. It's a really nice touch. And if you take a quick look, a close look at uh, the wall here, this is concrete but they're separated in tiles and then this really cool paint job. And it looks fantastic. And it just kind of shows you what they do with the concrete here. It's really, really cool. Awesome. And that's that. All right, so I have one more fun feature for you here. This big window opens up, letting all this air in. It's absolutely fantastic. Perfect for a warm Bali afternoon, get a cool breeze. Looking around at all the beautiful greenery, the Bali jungle vibes, it's absolutely beautiful. This property is called The Backyard, right next door over here. It's the same, it's identical, and it's called Salty. And they're both actually for sale. So what I love so much about them is that you get the feeling, the, everything that, would, that uh, a big villa in Bali has to offer, but it's nice and compact without feeling cramped. Everything fits, everything flows. Like I said earlier, plenty of space in the room. They've really done it well and all the materials are amazing. For more information on Bali Texture or about purchasing this property, go check out www.balitexture.com. Don't forget to like and subscribe for us. We really appreciate it. Let us know in the comments below what your favorite part of this villa is. And now it's time for me to swim. I think I found a shortcut right here. Or maybe I should go change and be a little safer. All right, I'll see you guys at the pool.